The fallen commando's spouses, parents and siblings brought their loved ones' portraits to the national tribute. Cédric de Pierrepont and Alain Bertoncello in civilian clothing, the way they remember them. President Emmanuel Macron gave his condolences, along with his wife Brigitte Macron, in tears. The soldiers' comrades then brought their coffins into the military complex courtyard as the band played a naval forces song in their honor. They died as heroes for France because for them nothing was more important than the mission and nothing more precious than the lives of the hostages. The commandos were killed in the operation to save two French tourists kidnapped by gunmen who had taken them from Benin to Burkina Faso. President Macron said there was no other choice but to order that operation that led to the rescue of four hostages. France never abandons its children, no matter the circumstances. A reference to the controversy that followed the operation. France's foreign minister accused the tourists of traveling to an area that authorities formally advised not to visit. And there has been criticism against the tourists for taking that risk. But since the release, it has been revealed that months ago, authorities did not classify Benin's Panjari Park as dangerous. The situation there degraded, though, in recent months and was flagged as orange, meaning no one should travel there unless it's absolutely necessary. After the kidnapping, the region was classified as a red zone. The tourists have voiced their regrets and sent their condolences to the grieving families. Now,